Hey guys, welcome to the Gaming PC Build of the Month for June 2022. My name is Corey with NoobComputerBuild.com. Uh, we're here again, June. Here's the updated builds. $1,500, $1,000, $800, and $500 gaming PC builds. If you haven't been here before the uh, and you kind of want a quick uh, little go around as to what the builds pertain to, the $1,500 build would be for those builders that want to build a gaming PC that can kind of game anything all the way up into 4K resolutions, the $1,000 build into 1440p resolutions at great FPS, and the $800 build going into uh, great FPS into 1080p resolutions, and the $500 build is an entry-level build just to kind of get into PC building, and we'll play any game out there but not maxed out obviously uh, those are kind of the generalized rules for each of the builds in terms of entry points and these builds are used as a framework for you to get started they don't may not necessarily come with all the bells and whistles uh, but you can kind of use these as a framework and customize as you go if you have a certain case that you like for example swap the case out but these are the best per dollar spent in terms of performance gaming performance uh, and that's how these are set up uh, and uh, are updated month to month. So let's get started with the June 2022 Gaming PC Builds of the Month, starting with the $1,500 Gaming PC Build. Uh, for this month, uh, uh, the CPU for the $1,500 build is the Intel Core i5-12400, coming in at $193.96. We include the stock cooler with this one, which is the Intel Laminar uh, R laminar rm1 uh, stock cooler uh, but we do recommend that you upgrade to another air cooler and you can probably do so for about 30 dollars or you can kind of go higher than that we do uh, have some upgrade suggestions on the website if you visit noobcomputerbuild.com for each of these builds if you do want suggestions for those the motherboard here is the gigabyte b660 gaming x mother uh, motherboard for 169.99 graphics card we have this month uh, and it's gone way down in price as you'll notice the trend in all of these builds uh, being much more affordable and I said this last month it was the most affordable month ever in a long long time this is the most affordable month ever for each of the builds in a long long time you'll see at the end here when we get to the final cost of this build graphics card we have is the asus tough gaming nvidia geforce rtx 3070 659.99 at the beginning of the month here uh, for some uh, memory we have the corsair vengeance lpx 6 and gigabyte 3600 megahertz memory 73.99 for an ssd we have a crucial p2 one terabyte ssd uh, nvme ssd 99.99 power supply evga supernova 750g5 119.99 and then the case is the corsair 4000d at 104 dollars 99 cents and this build comes into way under uh 1500 this month at 1382 dollars 86 cents which leaves a lot of wiggle room if you wanted to, if, you, if this was your budget and you wanted to add some upgrades um moving on to the next build the 1000 dollars gaming pc build of the month for june 2022 Again, we have the Intel Core i5-12400 CPU 193.96 uh, included a stock Intel cooler. The motherboard for this one is the Gigabyte B660M DS3H 119.99. The graphics card to power the $1,000 build is the FXX Radeon 6600 XT at a cheap, and I say cheap because it's way cheaper than it was before, <laughs> $379.99. The Met RAM is the Corsair Vengeance LPX 16 gigabyte kit, 3600 megahertz, $73.99. Storage, Crucial P2 500 gigabyte NVMe SSD at $54.99. Power supply, EVGA Supernova 650G5, $69.99. And then uh, the case is the NZXC H510, $84.99, coming into also under the budget this month at $977.90 for June 2022. Next build we have is the $800 gaming PC build of the month. This one comes in, uh, or the CPU is the Intel Core i3-12100, uh, $134.99. Again, we include the stock cooler with this one. Motherboard is Gigabyte B660M DS3H, $119.99. The uh, graphics card for this one is the GeForce RTX 3050. Again, this one's gone down, $339.99. Uh, the memory is the Corsair Vengeance LPX 16 gigabyte kit, 3600 megahertz at $73.99. And then the storage is the Crucial P2 500 gigabyte NVMe SSD, $54.99. Power supply is the Pivia ATX 600 watt, $51.99. The case for this one is the Zalman S3 uh, mid tower case at $60.99, coming into just over, this one's the, kind of the exception, but just over $800, uh, $830.93 at June 2022 at the moment. And finally, we have the $500, the entry-level gaming PC build for June 2022. So this one, this one's unique and special because it's uh, one of those ones that was put together uh, with uh, 
the fact that you don't actually need a graphics card. So you can get up and running, don't need to buy an expensive graphics card. You can get up in gaming and it leaves you open to buy one in the future if you have the money come then uh, to get faster and better gaming performance. But out of the box, it does game. And it's because of this CPU, the AMD Ryzen 5 5600, uh, 5600G um, uh, CPU that has integrated Radeon uh, graphics. So we have, and this comes out to 175 $175.11 and included as the stock AMD Wraith Stealth Cooler. Uh, the motherboard is the Gigabyte B550 MDS3H motherboard, $119. And then the graphics, as mentioned, is the integrated Radeon RX graphics included. Or if you had more money to spend, for example, you can go get a GTX 1650 um, as an upgrade suggestion. Uh, memory, Crucial Vengeance LPX 16 gigabyte kit, 3600 megahertz kit here, 7399. Storage is a SATA Kingston 240 gigabyte SSD, 2999. Power supply, Thermaltake Smart 500 watt power supply. Um, sorry, it's the Thermaltake Smart 500 watt power supply, $34.99. In the case is the Zalman S3 again at $60.99 to under $500, $494.07. So that's the four builds that we put together. Like I said, use these builds as a framework. These are the builds kind of, it gets you up to your budget or around your budget, and you can kind of have some wiggle room in terms of uh, customizing it and taking out things uh, if they don't suit you or uh, whether it's uh, performance or style, et cetera, or if you have a little more money to spend, you can kind of mix and match with some of these builds as well. Uh, but if you have any questions, yeah, do leave a comment in the comment section below or visit us at noobcomputerbuild.com where we have more builds as well as upgrade suggestions for each of these builds. But as per usual, thanks for tuning into the Gaming PC Builds of the Month. My name is Corey, uh, and leave a comment, and best of luck building um, your next gaming PC build.